in this video, revealing a step-by-step -step tutorial for retail arbitrage, what it is, and how complete beginners earning $100 to $700 a day with no experience. More at that after the intro. Hey guys, how's it going? Mike Vasile here. Welcome to this video. Before we actually begin, I want to remind you that several spots have opened up for this week's free workshop, where it's the fastest and easiest way to make money online. We literally have a 62-year-old woman go from zero to 160 grand profit in 90 days. Check it out in the free workshop below. So one of the reasons why I literally love retail arbitrage is it is what made me, okay? It is literally what made me and threw me onto this e-commerce journey that completely changed my life. You know, because before this, you know, I wanted to make money, right? Why wouldn't I, right? I was stuck financially. I felt like I had this ceiling in my income and I felt like my boss didn't actually respect me or understand exactly what I wanted to create out of my life. And I wanted to travel, I wanted to provide for my family, I wanted to live a life of abundance, but I did not know how to bridge the gap from where I was, which you could actually see where I was when I was in a place that I did not enjoy, literally wearing scrubs. I was a scrub and I wanted to be free, but I didn't have any skill sets. I was like, oh, I don't have the time. I don't have the money. I don't have the experience. How many of you guys feel that? You're like, oh, I want to make money, but you don't, you don't, you think you need time. You think you need money. You need, you think you need experience to go ahead and make this happen, right? That's literally what I felt. And retail arbitrage was what literally gave me the initial confidence to actually make it happen, to then really dive deep into e-commerce when I started making money. And then I went from you know five grand in 30 days to 1.6 million that first year in e-commerce. So how was I able to do it? Like I said, getting started in retail arbitrage and getting my foot initially wet. So in this video, what I'm gonna do is I'm going to systematically review the different methods that I did with retail arbitrage, the old ways and the new ways, and how you can even get started without actually having to leave the comforts of your own home. You can literally retail arbitrage from literally like wherever you're sitting watching this video. Does that make sense, right? And I, people are like, oh, well, I don't know. This is what I did, okay? So I'm gonna show you exactly what I did, right? So the first way to make money with retail arbitrage is understanding what is retail arbitrage. It's a very simple, it's like the age old adage of buy low, sell high, buy low, sell high. That is what is known as arbitrage. You know, like going to like, for example, you know, say if I lived in a poor neighborhood, right? And I'm like, you know, buying and selling like baseball cards, right? I would literally buy the, the, the baseball cards that I know are very valuable and I would literally go ahead to a richer neighborhood and sell it to people that had more money. That's arbitrage taking something in one to another. Where else do people arbitrage? People arbitrage from China to the US all the time. You know all those things that are made from China? Those Louis Vuitton purses, right? All those things made in China, they have been arbitraged. Someone bought it low and then sold it high. Does it make sense? So one of the first ways that I did retail arbitrage was literally back in the day when me and my dad were just getting started in e-commerce. We wanted to make a little bit of money. We want to get our feet wet. We literally downloaded the Amazon seller app. It's free. Just literally try it, right? Just download it on your app. It's on your phone, right? And every Sunday, what we did is after church, we would literally go to the Walmarts, the Costco's, and we would just scan this app everywhere. Why? Because this app will literally tell us if we could sell it on Amazon and how much profit we can make. Right, and one of the little cheat codes we did is whenever there's a holiday sale, that's when you wanna do this the most because that's when it's at the cheapest so you could get it at the lowest price and then when the prices go back up on, for example, Amazon, you could sell it at the higher price. You get more of a spread of a profit because you bought even lower and sold even higher when it was more in demand. Does that make sense? Like backpacks are really popular during you know, the school session, right? Like, you know, we literally have like, for example, we have people in our community that did this with uh, like the red lobster mix, right? We literally have people in our community do this with like crackers, okay? You'd be surprised. Literally just download this and on holidays or on Sundays, go to the clearance aisle and just see what you could sell on Amazon, buy low and then sell it high. So that's the first way. Well, what else, you know, had I done? You know, we did that and it was kind of like a little bit harder because I'm like, oh, I don't wanna, like if I literally future project and I saw the life that I wanted to live, right? If I wanted to travel, if I wanted to live my life, if I wanted to go ahead and say, hey, I wanna spend some time in Thailand, in Bali, in Europe for a bit. I cannot physically be in these Walmarts. So I was like, I need to find another business model in the retail arbitrage. So remember, retail arbitrage is buying low and then selling high. So I was wondering, I was like, well, what if, what if? How was I doing the retail arbitrage anyways? Uh, so I was buying low on like, for example, places like Walmart and Costco, and then I was selling high on Amazon. Okay, so those were those two platforms, Walmart and Amazon. I started thinking, I was like, huh, what if I just do this online, right? But instead, what if I did it online and I sold it first 
and only did I make the money, will I actually buy it low. Here's an example, we use Walmart, right? Walmart, we, we go to the clearance aisle and what? Dude, Walmart has a website, check this out. Walmart has a website right here, bam, walmart.com, right? Go to ebay.com, because now eBay's our Amazon. Type in the word bunk bed cherry. What do you see when you type in the word bunk bed cherry? You will see all of these things that are bunk beds. Guys, check this out, look at this. This one is going for 361 bucks. Let me just click on this bad boy. And over this one, this one also, like the exact, they're the exact same bunk bed, right? Check this out, bam, look at this. This has been sold twice, $361, right? $361, but check this out. This is the exact same thing exists on Walmart for $249. So in the olden day, in the olden day, what I would have to do is I would have to go to Walmart, scan it, I'm like, oh my God, I can make a bunch of money, and then I would buy it with my own money, and then send it, and then sell it on eBay. But then, with this new method, you're like, wait, I don't have to buy this, I should sell this first. I should only buy this if I could only make a sale. So what did I start doing? I started, like, in my free time, I kid you not, copy and pasting 10 pictures, 20 pictures, 30 pictures from Walmart, Amazon, Costco, uh, like where else, Overstock, Wayfair.com. I started copy and pasting those pictures onto eBay. Why? Because initially, before you get advanced and get like an anchor store, and you'll know more about that when you proceed in this, you're gonna have to pay money. But literally in the beginning, when you first start selling on eBay, it's completely free to post. Literally just try posting one thing. Post this bunk bed. Post this bunk bed, and literally you'll start seeing it. And this was the weirdest thing when I realized, I was like, wait, what? This doesn't really have that much risk. I literally posted you know, a picture on eBay, and I just waited. And one day, like on my eBay app, it went cha-ching, 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 and I was like, what? I got a sale, and it was like a piece, of, it was like some type of toy that I sold right before Christmas, right? And I just saw it, and I was like, oh my God, I don't have this inventory, I don't have this in stock, but I have the money, and I have the shipping details because this customer just bought from eBay. So I can literally take the shipping details and the money and buy it and arbitrage it at another place at a lower cost and then ship it directly to the customer. I'm like, huh, this is amazing, right? This is literally amazing. So that's what I did and check it out. That's literally what these people are doing too. If you literally go ahead and see other items, you'll see that they're selling 468, 88 other items right now. If each one of these products just got one sale a month, one sale a month at even just $10 profit, and guys, this one, is $100 more than what they got it on Walmart, right? $100 more, so their profit's probably like 50 bucks. But say you only profit 10 bucks for every single big ticket thing that you sell. That's still five grand a month profit, guys. Five grand, now with this method, I only got it to $100 a day profit, consistently at most over like a range period of time. But that's already life changing money, right? Like what would that be able to do for you? Does that make sense? And of course, like there's even higher levels to this, like what we ended up doing like for example, uh, overstock.com. Overstock.com is another place that like we've used and they have this thing which is like a rewards program where then if you sign up for it, you literally get like a one or 2% cash back, right? So for every single money that you spend of your customer's money, you get cash back, right? What's another place we could do? Another place to get cash back is like for example, Walmart and Rakuten. So imagine this, imagine if I sold, I don't know, uh, let's just do the math, five bunk beds a day. Five bunk beds a day, right? If I sell five bunk beds at 361 bucks, not only did I profit 50 bucks, but remember I have to buy this, right? But I'm not spending my own money, I'm using the customer's money. I'm literally using the customer's money, but what if, what if, before I actually buy it, before I go on Walmart, what if I click on this one extra button on Rakuten, which is free, where I could get a 1% cash back through Walmart? What does that actually mean? For every $100 that I spend, that's a dollar for free. So if I buy five of these a day with my customer's money, right? That's nearly, what, like over a thousand bucks that I don't have to spend, it's my customer spending. That is essentially 10 free dollars a day in passive income, 10 free dollars. Oh, but Mike, I just spent a thousand dollars for that. No, your customer did. But remember, you're already profiting. What else can you do? Before you actually go ahead and click on this and then go on Walmart, when you go ahead and buy it, you could go ahead and double dip and get like a Travel Awards credit card or uh, one with like bonus points, where for every single like dollar that you spend, you get one point in travel rewards points, right? Then you get free travel, guys. That's how I like, for example, travel for free. That's how I go and fly business class for free. That's how I stay in hotels for free because I literally let my customers pay for the cost and then the cost is on my credit card, but the credit card bill is paid by my customers. Does that make sense? And that's literally, like if you add all these things, you could literally do a lot of cool things with retail arbitrage, guys. But obviously that's just some ways to make money online. If you want the fastest and easiest way, 
to literally do all these things, travel hack, and make money online the fastest without ever leaving your home or ever showing your face. And it's exactly what Dina, a stay-at-home mom did at age 47 years old and went from zero to 30 grand a month in five to eight weeks without actually having her own products or services and without showing her face, as well as hundreds of other people that did the exact same thing from all over the world. Then sign up for this week's free workshop below. Check out this video and this podcast video. Hopefully this helps. Love you guys. See you guys later. Woo!